If you love God, prove it. Let's go to Matthew chapter 25. Verses 34 through 46. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. Then shall the king say unto them on his right hand, Come ye blessed of my father. Inherit the kingdom prepared for you from the foundation of the world. 35. For I was in hunger, and ye gave me meat. I was thirsty, and ye gave me drink. I was a stranger, and ye took me in. Naked, and ye clothed me. I was sick, and ye visited me. I was in prison, and ye came unto me. 37. Then shall the righteous answer him, saying, Lord, when saw we thee in hunger, and fed thee, or thirsty, and gave thee drink? When saw we thee a stranger, and took thee in, or naked, and clothed thee? Or when saw we thee sick, or in prison, and came unto thee. 40. And the king shall answer and say unto them, Verily, I say unto you, and as so much, hmm, and as much as ye have done it unto one of the least of these my brethren, ye have done it unto me. 41. Then shall he say also unto them on the left hand, Depart from me, ye cursed, into everlasting fire, prepared for the devil and his angels. For I was an hungered, and ye gave me no meat. I was thirsty, and ye gave me no drink. I was a stranger, and ye took me not in, naked, and ye clothed me not, sick, and in prison, and ye visited me not. 44. Then shall they also answer him, saying, Lord, when saw we thee and hungered, or a thirst, or a stranger, or naked, or sick, or in prison, and did not minister unto thee. 45. Then shall he answer them, saying, Verily, I say unto you, and as much as ye did it, not to one of the least of these, ye did it not to me. 46. And these shall go away into everlasting punishment, but the righteous into life eternal. Okay. Who should we be donating to? Who should we be helping? From my understanding of this passage here, I believe we should be donating and helping people who are in need, people that are thirsty, people who are hungry, people that are in prison, so on 
and so on. People who need clothes. People who need shoes. And stuff like that. There is nothing wrong with donating to a church unless they are mishandling what you are giving them. Some people may believe that the way that they should handle people outside the church, they may believe that they should only preach, teach, or tell them about God. I believe that is wrong. I believe there are people who hate God who may blame God for the bad things that are going on in their life. So let's say you go to that person and try to tell that person about God. Do you believe that person is going to listen to you. If that person hates God, if that person blames God for whatever is wrong in their life now, do you believe he or she or they going, hmm, do you believe they will listen to you if you come to them with your teaching or preaching? Maybe not. What if those people are in need? What if you come to them and help them in their time of need? Will they be more willing? Will they be willing to listen to you? Will they be willing to give Jesus Christ a chance or another try? I believe it is easy to go to a person and say some things about God. But I believe it is more difficult to do things for people, to be there for them, to continue to show them love. Let me say this. Some people may believe that by them teaching and preaching. Let me say this. I believe it is God the Father that draws people to Jesus Christ. If we go to Proverbs 11 and 30, and if you see the end here, and he that winneth souls is wise. So here, I believe this is saying that we can win souls. I believe that
you can win souls for Jesus Christ by showing people love. I believe everyone is not going to listen to you if you teach, preach, or tell them about God. But I believe they may be more willing to listen if you are there for them. If they are having a bad time in life now, if they blame God for the bad things that are happening to them now, why in the world would they want to listen to a person talking about God? Make sure you are showing love to other people. God bless you.